Byron started football in 1939. Pictured here is the very first team. It was organized and coached by Dana West. This was a touch football team. Very common. Schools that first started into the sport did not engage in full contact football simply because they did not yet have the equipment. So this was a touch team and they had their games at stop 69. This marks 80 years of football in our school history. While we did not engage in the sport continuously for all 80 years, we did participate for the bulk of that period. I'd like to speak briefly about a few people that are in this picture. G. Hitchcock, I believe, is Gordon Hitchcock. He would become a Justice of the Peace in the Village. Next to him is Hall of Famer Claire Traver. He would become a town clerk. And in the back row is Milt Casey. He would become a coach here in Port Byron in the future. Let's sit back and enjoy a retrospect of Port Byron football.
I'm going to break a very basic rule. The letter I is never in the word team, but sometimes life just happens and it becomes a great source of inspiration. This one individual that I'm speaking about, I'm sure you all know him. Perhaps you've even spent a five minute lunch with him. Recently, his name, his call name was considered too dangerous for Facebook. The minute I heard that, I had this vision. So I'm going to break my rule and admit that the ending clip, I hope you're going to enjoy it. And it was inspired by our very own Bomber Bristol. This is an image of a Panther referee that appeared in the 1970s yearbook. Keep an eye open for him because he's going to be in the finale. Now, folks, just remember, there are no rules in cartoons. Enjoy.